Hello, Marcus Lim here with World's Finest Teen Titans by Mark Waid and Emanuela Lupacino, right, with Jody Belay. And this has been very well received, this mini series, six issues, exploring the early years of the Teen Titans as a team. So you got Robin, the leader, the team leader, we've got Wonder Girl, we've got Bumblebee, Kid Flash, thing that is Speedy and Acolet, okay? So six of them. And this collects the six issues as I mentioned. Now I don't actually have the six um, issues. <clears throat> but uh, yeah, but here you go. So it's from uh, before they were the Titans, they were the Teen Titans. And this is a fresh take on the origins. So from issue one of six. Mark Wade and Emanuela La Pacino, and a little bit about the creative team, right? So Mark Wade, uh, right, he's found, uh, seems like uh, he's been, you know, having great success with World's Finest Superman, Batman, right? This is one of the issues uh, that I've got <coughs> for my collection. So, so yeah, Batman, Superman, World's Finest, and this issue also happens to be the one. Uh, and that's also drawn by Emanuela Le Pacino, right? Same artist for this series. So this is the the Supergirl and Robin date um, issue, right? A very nice little issue, this one. Um, but yeah, so Mark Wade uh, has pretty much what he's been doing is to take like a fresh take on uh, these uh, heroes that we love, right? These beloved characters from the Silver Age, but giving it like a sort of like a modern twist. And it's been working really well, and he's applying the same formula to the Teen Titans. Alright, so let's have a, let's have a look uh, at this um, series. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so let's take the jacket off. Okay. All right, let's go check it here. Okay, and here is the book without the jacket. So it's a nice wraparound cover of the entire team. Okay, all six of them. And so yeah, okay. Let's let's take a look inside. So World's Finest Teen Titans. Okay, starting from issue one. All right, so that's issue number one. All right, this is a, a Robin variant cover by Evan Shainer. All right. Okay, so right from the start, right. Mark White does a really great job of introducing each of the characters. Kid Flash, Aqualad, Wonder Woman, Speedy, uh, Bumblebee, and uh, yeah, obviously Robin, the boss man. <laughs> um, and you can see that the, uh, the, the, uh, each of these characters sort of mentors appear as well. Like Batman, for instance, like Batman with Robin, and a lot of the fun comes also from the the uh, the interplay, right? The dynamics between the characters, um, like for instance, yeah, in this one, yeah, we've got this issue number two is a bit of a you know haunted house ghost. Uh, story and Mark Waite really really gets these characters right each of them has their own voice they really feel like like three-dimensional characters and uh, this one the third issue where the, uh, the Titans go off to a, a convention <laughs> unfortunately Robin is stuck with Batman who uh, doesn't approve of him going off <laughs> the convention. So uh, yeah, and yeah, the uh, 
the interplay between Bruce and Dick Grayson is also a highlight. <clears throat> we see the differences in the way uh, that they approach things. And yeah, and regarding the the uh, the artwork as well, right? It also has that a bit of a retro feel, but with a again with a modern touch, right? And that that's that's exactly what what they're going for, right? In in this in this series, it is a as I mentioned before, it is a, a fresh look, a fresh take on this uh, superheroes in the early days, you know, from the Silver Age, but giving it that modern modern uh, twist, modern touch, whatever you call it, <clears throat> with, you know, like a sort of modern take on uh, character motivations that I guess modern readers are expecting, right? Yeah. So, so definitely a very fun and ex a very fun book to get into. It's also got that light-hearted tone to it that makes it quite suitable for for younger readers. But I would say, you know, overall, it's a very accessible book. You don't need to know really like much of background about these characters in order to get into 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 the book right and uh yeah <laughs> nice work so he has batman has a heart after all <laughs> um and that's it right six issues uh let's go titans together so not sure if this will continue i mean i do hope so i mean it's been so well received that i just don't see why you know dc won't let mark wade and emmanuela continue to tell more of these stories in this style so here's some extras right character sketches by emmanuela uh yeah and i didn't mention about the villains as well right there's the Terror Titans. <laughs> Toy Boy is uh, one of them. Um, but yeah, so then we've got the variant covers for issue 1, issue 1, issue 1, and then issue 2 variant here, issue 2, issue 3, issue 3, 3, 4, 4, 4, 5, 5, 5. Six, 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 and that's it. And yeah, so yeah, I, I have actually <laughs> gone through each of these volumes as well, right? The Batman Superman World's Finest. And definitely check these those out as well. Um because yeah, if you like this one, you know, I'm pretty sure you will enjoy the uh the Batman Superman World's Finest, which is actually still ongoing <clears throat> all right so that's really it for this uh you know look at the teen titans world signers hardcover uh book with mark way and emmanuela lupacino as i mentioned yeah just uh uh bring brings you know the the fun the nostalgic feel of that era silver age right those bygone days but giving it a modern twist so a really really cool and fun combination so yeah definitely check it out World's Finest Teen Titans by Mark Wade and Emanuela Di Pacino. So hope you enjoyed this video and please like and subscribe and I will see you in another video.